Normally I don't do video responses. I was watching a video from Michael Aranda. He spoke in the video about a moment in his life between him and his mother and how this moment had changed himself as a person. And I thought of something immediately when I was watching the video. A moment in my life that completely changed me as a person and my whole attitude towards me, my family and everyone that I really care about. When I was about eight or nine years old, me and my friends always used to walk to the corner shop just before we go home from school. At school you used to get your dinner money off your parents and then you used to pay for your dinner but sometimes you used to have a little bit more change. That change used to go to the corn shop where you used to buy sweets or stickers and things like that. There was a sticker album out for the Premiership and it was something that us as kids always used to swap, trade and try to fill. And the idea is the one with the most stickers normally wins the whole game and can fill the album. So normally I'd use all my money at the corner shop, buy all my stickers and try to get as many stickers as I possibly could to fill this album. But one time... I didn't have enough money. I spent all my money at school and then I had no money. So everyone else went to the corner shop and I went home and I felt really bad because I wasn't fitting in with the group. I walked into my house, I went upstairs, I went into my mum's room and I went to her purse and took out a crispy five pound note that she had probably got that day. With this five pound note, I felt I could buy as many stickers as I want. I could be on the higher sticker archive than all my friends and I will be able to swap with all of them and probably finish off my album. And I thought to myself, it wasn't really stealing because I could always replace this. So I go to the corner shop, I buy all my stickers and I walk back home to find my mum on the bed crying her eyes out with her purse. It was the fact that her son had taken that money from her purse without asking and had stolen that money and used it on their own greed. That probably broke her heart the most. She asked me, why did you take the money? Why why do this? A kid response was, I just wanted my stickers. I, want, I wanted to get my sticker album completed. I was gonna replace it and I'm sorry. You say you're sorry and it, it doesn't hit you until you really think about it. I had a life changing moment where I didn't want to upset my family so much. I woke up to find five pounds next to my bed and I felt disgusted with myself. I asked my mum, what's this? And she was like, well, next time you want five pounds, just ask me. You don't need to take it from my purse. We're family. If you want money, ask me. I have never told this story to anyone in my life. Friends or strangers, I've never said this to anyone. The only people that knew was me, my brother, my dad and my mum. And now you.